3509, Los Angeles Center, Ida, please, John Wayne Altitude, 3009. Los Angeles Center, November 350, Kilo Tango with you, flight level 10, good evening. Los Angeles Center, November 350, Kilo Tango, Los Angeles Center, Roger, good evening. American C9 Radar contact over J Ward, turn right heading 290. That'll be a vector for the Alice Wing C0 right approach to John Wayne. And this is the maintain of 6000. We're seeing 6000, what was the heading again for American 629? American 629 heading 290, that'll be a vector for the C0 right approach. Right 290 for American 629. Area 1043, you disregard the crossing restriction at base after Simon, the set of main pain is 7,000. Yeah, Simon down to 7,000 for American 1143, disregard the restriction. American 629 at 6,000, reduce speed to 1809. All right, folks, so we just crossed over into the Los Angeles Center airspace, and we are cruising at flight level 210, and shortly we'll be in getting our instructions for our uh, arrival into the Lindbergh area. So for now, just sit back and relax and enjoy the scenery, and uh, hopefully we have a good touchdown. It's always questionable. I'm flying online and trying to record a video, so hopefully it goes well. American 629, 718, 4000. 718, 4000, American 629. Los Angeles Air, United 1073 at flight level 270. United 1073, Los Angeles Center, Roger, good evening, lower here at about uh, in less than 40 miles. Roger, United 1073. American 1143, departs Santa Monica on a 070 heading after Santa Monica, the 184,000 vector for the C5 West approach. Departs Santa Monica 070 and after Santa Monica down to 470, American 143. Okay, 1073 pilots crashing the sun of 9000, the Santa Barbara Alta, there are 3007. Pilots discretion down to 9000, United 1073. American 629 is 6 miles from Vaughn Key, turn left on 8210, means yeah, the sun of 183,400 will establish a global blizzard for the Alice from 80 right approach. Alright, left heading 210 and descending 2300 and then uh, to establish a localizer for 2-0 right, American 629. American 629, uh, maintain 3400, 3400 and we'll establish a localizer. 
We J3400 on the establishment of localizer, American 619, thank you. So just checking the chart, we'll still be coming in for a landing roughly over 13,000 pounds, so our V-Ref is going to be 102. So I'm going to get that set up and continue to wait for our instructions for arrival. United 365 Heavy, runway 25 right, intersection Juliet, taxi via Charlie, Charlie 6, Bravo, and Juliet. Charlie, Charlie 6, Bravo, F25 right, Vision 25. And uh, United 365, just confirm runway 25 right, intersection Juliet. Uh, Charlie, Charlie 6, and Bravo, and then Juliet. Uh, and your scenery might have been shown at the intersection with the Fox truck, if you're aware. Intersection Juliet, Juliet, uh, 25 right, Vision Central Center United 404, flight level 380, uh, flight level 380. United 404, Los Angeles Center, good evening, United, please. United 404, radar can tank, six or miles east of the light, VOR. That is four zero four for planning purposes. You can expect to rest for uh, about one hundred and fifty miles or so. Yeah, four zero four, Roger. American 1143, settling to 3,000, they turned in about 8 miles. Okay, descend to 3,000, American 1143. American 629, runway 20 right, clear to land, wind calm. Clear to land, uh, 20 right, American 629. American 1143, turn right heading 170. Alright, go 170 for American 1143. Okay, 365, heavy holding short, remember 25 right. United 365 Heavy, thanks for waiting to you, five right at Juliet, clear for takeoff, wind 280 to destroy. 
Take off to five right, three, seven. Area 1143, seven and a half from Lima, driving C30, maintaining 3000, we will establish on the localized and third ILS runway, C5 off the route. Okay, around the 230, and we'll maintain 3000, close up to the approach during 143. Yeah, it's at 3 Santa Barbara reporting 10703, altimeter 3007, expect ILS from A7 approach from Gavi. Uh, expect ILS from A7 from Gavi, OD9073. You can maintain 2,500 out to establish. 2,500 American 1143. It's been 73 cross Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa Barbara. Gaddy OWR at or above 5,000 cleared ILS from Wake Southern Bridge, Santa American today 49, you can turn left at the end, tanks the alpha to the ramp of the industry. Have a good night. Tank 020 right and we'll rain this frequency taxi now, but to the ramp, American 619, thanks for your help, brother. You're welcome. American 619, Charlie Alpha, Charlie Alpha, Charlie Alpha. Yeah, 365 heavy radar contact is 5,000. Climb and maintain audible 340. I'll have direct venture for you at about 5 miles. Hey, up to 340. Uh, 365. Temperature 
south side is negative United Tree Celsius. Eddie flooding 280 would able to see right then true and resume the venture of seven and merger. So two three four zero direct venture of a turret departure United three six five and American 1143, any exit right, cross from way to the high right, taxi, Bravo, and then Charlie Niner, and Charlie Niner, and Charlie Niner, and Charlie Niner, and Charlie Niner, Okay, we are clear at Hotel 4, and we'll go to the icing on uh, here. right side, and taxi, and via your instructions, American 1143, taxi. Thinking about landing now. So we need to make sure we are all de-iced. already kicking in, so we're going to want to stop that because he hasn't given us any instructions yet. So let's go. that far off of course. So let's just go back up. Let me know. Uh yeah we're going to need to get back to back around United Head 73. Let's go back yeah, up. Yeah 1073 Dr. Campbell the approach point is flying 130 into Southern 18 uh, uh Southern 18 3500. Alright heading 130 down 3500 United Head 73. Fly on that, and we'll mess with the V nav once we get to. Like I said, the V nav on this plane is, or the autopilot is. Is it? Is it there's got it's, it has some bugs in it. That's for sure. But knowing that it has bugs kind of makes it easier for me to anticipate that's going to do something crazy when you start touching. Yeah, four zero four clear direct surfer surfer to arrival Santa so we've got 64 United, uh, nautical sure. miles to Los Angeles, VOR. Uh, so, not that far off, he should be giving us our instructions. United 1073, Trinity 250. Right, 250, United 1073.
Three right, ten degrees. Ten degrees right, United Ten degrees. Okay, ten seventy three, four and a half miles from Pat. It's zero four zero, maintain three thousand five hundred will establish the localizer. Clear to Alice from East Southern First, Santa Barbara. Right, zero four zero three thousand five hundred still established, clear to high west from eight seven approach, United ten seventy three. Okay, 1073, Railway 7 in Santa Barbara, clear to land, wind 0703. Clear to land, Railway 7, United 1073.
Los Angeles Center, November 350 Kilo Tango Sagan. Alright, so, it appears that there's a problem with the voice again. It was coming in just fine, and then it's not, but that's alright. We will be A-OK. -okay. Alright, now let's activate our... vertical navigation Again, it does funny stuff, and uh, so it's going to be interesting to see what problems it gives me this time. this goes until we get closer to Bayview, which is in 64 nautical miles, so it's got us descending ever so slowly, so we should be at 17,000 crossing Otis. As you see, there's nobody using voice right now, and it looks like the Los Angeles Center went off frequency and potentially will come back on frequency uh, because they're having problems with voice. They just click back on. <clears throat> so it happens. You guys, 404 LA Center radio check. Los Angeles Center, good evening. Delta 3571 with you, flight level 380. Delta 3571, Los Angeles Center, good evening. Ida, please. Delta 3571, Ida, not observed, Squawk 7177, and Ida. Looks like we got a little bit of clouds we're coming through here.
3571, Los Angeles, a radio check. Uh, I read you five by five. So, three sixty five. Uh, three sixty five. Thank you very much. Contact Oakland Center on one three two point two. Good night. Installation, I appreciate you back. Fifty five contacts, oh, one center one three two point two, good night. So it looks like he's got some voice, some not. I think we're good. <clears throat> 19 mile, nautical miles to Otis. We'll see if we meet the uh, altitude there of 17,000 with this vertical navigation. Back off again. And at this rate, I think the VNAV is still kind of funky. So they want to ask you to listen to radiation? Delta 3571, Los Angeles, sir. I'm just kind of helping it out here. Well, I'm just having a good evening, Compass 5865, level 2. Compass 5856, Los Angeles, Sutter, Roger, good evening, verify you're able to receive on voice transmission. What's the firm give your five back one? Compass 5856, Roger, be advised, under minute voice issues uh, due, to, due to the previous voice server I was on disconnecting, it appears that that might have migrated over to the other uh, voice server that I'm just connecting to use, use, use caution, be prepared to protect them. Yeah, so it's his, it's definitely his, uh, Delta 3571, Los Angeles, we'll set a radio check. Remember 350, Kilo Los Angeles, we'll set a radio check. Los Angeles Center, I read you 5x5, five five, November 35, Kilo Tango. November. And as soon as I say that, uh, he goes in and out. Los Angeles Center, November 35, Kilo Tango. If you can hear me, you cut out as you were responding to me. I don't know if you can, I don't know if the voice issues are persisting.
Alright, so now it looks like the VNAV is acting correct because we want 16.5 at Hubbard, and as you can see, it came up. So I think the V Alt is. the VNAV is doing what it needs to do. So we'll see if it comes back down. In the meantime, let's look at our. So at Rebo, we want 2,000. Okay. All right. <clears throat> so we have that set up for 2,000. And as you can hear, he's coming in. <laughs> Rover 350, Kilo Tango Lost. There you go, Chet. Roger, Los Angeles Center. I hear you 5x5 five five now, November 350, Kilo Tango. Rover 350, Kilo Tango, thank you very much. Send VMU 5 arrival and expect a localizer runway to do stuff. Information Golf is current at Los Angeles, uh, San Diego. Roger, and you're most welcome. I will just send via the Bayview 5, and Information Golf is current at Lindbergh, November Kilo, 350 Tango. Alright, so we're getting closer, so let's see if our... Delta 3571, Los Angeles Federal Radio Check. Hubbard, we want... 3571. Uh, thank goodness, I think I got everybody screwed away. Bell 3571, just confirm cram and we need to gain level 180 to zero. Jurassic Grand at 180, 3571. Got a 5856 cross, Simon, that I mean, team 1000, the Montana was now 7008. Alright, had to put a new battery. Uh, uh, cross, Simon, at 180. Uh, to internet. Ghost of the 856 side uh, negative. You can leave the future direction if fine. Bayview's 15, but it's still not, so this. This thing is acting really funny. Reach you 5x5, five five. how about me? Aircraft calling for radio check. Read, read you 5x5, five five. how about me? All right. So we're going down. And it looks like we're going to have to continue the approach. Los Angeles Center, good evening. Yeah, United 24 with you. Uh, we have actually, Manually, uh, making this uh, interesting. Right, Normally. <laughs> You got 24 Los Angeles Center, good evening. Just verify you are receiving my voice transmission, correct? Uh, you're coming to 555. You got 24, thank you. Just well, please, 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 please. Got the 5856 LA Center radio check. United 24, clear to Phoenix. Hold one departure, thermal transition that is filed, climb via the Stedix, that means speed 5,000, expect follow 33010, but it's departure. Departure frequency 125.8, block 7175. And let's pull back. It looks like our. Okay, it's so looking 7175 for United 24, this evening. VNAF has decided. Yeah, United 24, read that correct. Thanks for calling in with that. Go to Spectrum 825, right at Juliet for departure. And the Which altimeter, right, Julia, for departure, uh, call which I forgot yeah, to report. adjust, it's 3011. American 678, Los Angeles Federal Radio Check. Cell 3571, Ada Seco, Los Angeles, altimeter 3008, wind 2, diner, crash wind 3006, descend via river 3 arrival. At River Intersection, cleared ILS runway 25 left approach. Alright, so as we're approaching, let me just go ahead and get our condition.
condition levers, prop levers and condition levers all the way back up. Should be all at 100% here across the board. And speed is good, it's under 250 knots. And I'm just going to go ahead and get the lights on now. We got the landing lights on and we'll get recognition lights on. We get a little further down. <coughs> Excuse me. So hey, like General Aircraft, if you are able to hear the, the transmission, voice transmissions of LA Center, I'm going to be switching voice servers once again. I'll be back in just a moment. Alright, so he's going to switch voice servers yet again. And hopefully, our King Air decides to follow the vertical navigation that we have set forth. As you can see here, it's finally decided to do a good job. I don't, you know, it just, it's just real tricky. You know, I, I had to use the vertical profile. Back on frequency radio check, please. Los Angeles Center, November. Uh, uh, multiple pilots calling all at once, <laughs> and I don't get, uh, don't get a usual. Don't mind that uh, this time around. I will another occasion. So thirty-five seventy-one eight effective at Los Angeles South Center three zero zero eight one three zero zero six to send via the River Three arrival at River Third ILS from a T five left approach. Clear River Three two five left. We have Echo thirty-five seventy-one. Thank you. All right. Hey, Teddy, if you didn't hear me previously, you get to leave the restriction as I would say. Now, the funny thing is, is that he wants me to... American 292 just about to top of the set. He wants American me... American 292 Center, Aiden Gray, cross assignment, I'm sorry, correction, cross above the enemy, team 16,000, Las Vegas, altitude 004. There's a four, uh, fuzzy one six sixteen thousand American two nine two eighty nine. He wants me to arrive. I'm not going to mess with the departure at this point. He's probably going to give me some vectors, but it should line exactly up with what we already have. American six seventy eight. I sent a radio check. So we got the altimeter set. <coughs> my range so we can get a better look here Left turn for Clomin. Clomin, however you want to say it. And he says negative on the voice server. Yep, the D-56 LA Center radio check. Los Angeles Center, November 350 Kilo Tango. I can hear you. I'm not sure if he can. Rubber Zero Kilo Tango, yeah, thanks. It's uh, probably just uh, it has to deal with certain aircraft, but that's no worries at all. I can hear Zero Kilo Tango. Park Cloman on the published heading after Cloman, the Southern 18 at 5,000. Roger, depart Cloman on the published heading, descend to maintain 5,000 for November Kilo Tango. All right. So, we will simply drop down to 5,000 and 
and uh, we can control this thing the rest of the way in. Manually, I suppose. Let's get our recognition light on now. There we are. Don't mind my son in the background. Daughter is seeing to his needs. he's got going on, but... We need to get down to... Four thousand. Probably not going to have him on... Rover 350 Kilo Tango, 718, 4000. Down to 4000, November 350 Kilo Tango. Alright, so we actually do have them. On there, and we were going down to 4, whether he liked it or not. <coughs> Alright. Hopefully this records. Last time I did a flight in here and tried to record it. The fog messed my... Air over 350 Kilo Tango, this is 17 at 3000. You are 6 miles from Rainbow, trading 250, maintain 3000. We'll establish clear the localizer relay to you, summit approach. Right, 250 down to 3000, clear localizer approach for runway 27 November at Kilo Tango. All right. Think rate. Think rate. Think rate. All right. Think rate. Sink rate, sink rate, sink rate. All right. And Rebo, we should be at uh, Rebo. We will be at two thousand. So you should be giving us that here any minute now. Let's go down another couple of hundred feet. Let's slow our roll a little bit. Back on the power. Rubber 350 Kilo Tango, Kadek Lumberg Tower, 118.3. Good evening. 118.3. Have a good evening. All right. Tower's on. So 2500. 8.300. Hopefully his stuff works. Lindbergh Tower. 2500. Lindbergh Tower, 2, November 350 Kilo Tangle with you for runway 27 localizer. Five zero Kilo Tango, Lindbergh Tower, good evening. Winds variable at 3, runway 27, clear to land. Runway 27, clear to land, November Kilo Tango. All right, so we're slowing our speed here. And... Gear is down. Flaps, of course, and I... I'm gonna go full manual here. All right. 
Let's get her on the ground, people. Last time we had a, a lot more uh, fog coming in. So we're on runway 27 here. We're going to, you know, land, probably hit the runway, taxi all the way down, and then we're going to take a right. We're going to pick up Charlie and go <laughs> all the way back, basically, to the beginning of, you know, where runway 27 starts, but then we'll take a left turn. And, uh,. We will be at the General Aviation Parking. <clears throat> so I hope you guys have enjoyed this flight. One thousand. Uh, into the Lindbergh area. As you can see, not only pilots have uh, issues, but the air traffic control that provides us with, you know, the services on VATSIM, they can also have their issues as well. But they do a great job. And I uh, commend them for that. It takes a lot of work to uh, get up to the point where they can control us and stuff like that. So, five hundred. So we're just coming right on in. Nice little glide slope there. Four hundred. Three hundred. Minimums. All right, and we're landing. Two hundred. And we're going to be landing. Let's bring her down just a little bit. Two hundred. Minimums. And let's make sure we clear this building here. A little low, but that's all right. I like to bring it in kind of low here. Get our speed up just a tad. One hundred. Fifty. Yeah, we're just a little bit below. Forty. That's okay. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. All right. And we got a little touchdown here. And we're not going to make that turn off course. Reverse free. Below 60 knots. Alright, and we're just going to coast her down the runway till our next turn. Exit left contact ground 123 points Roger, exit left when able, contacting ground, November 35, Kilo Tango. Alright, so let's come over here. I wanted to go left, I mean right, to General Aviation, but it uh, doesn't look like that's going to happen. So let's just get clear of the runway, and we'll contact ground. stop here let's see what grounds radio is ground one two three nine all right one two three point nine there we go limber ground november three five kilo tango with you just off of runway two seven Good evening, November 350 Kilo Tango, Lindbergh Ground. Say your parking request. Roger, I'm requesting general aviation, please. All right, taxi general aviation parking via uh, Bravo, Bravo 6, cross our uh, whole short runway 27, then the taxi will be. Uh, Charlie 6, Charlie the parking. Uh, let me repeat that for you. Bravo, Bravo 6, Charlie 6, Charlie 
parking whole short runway 27. Roger, Bravo, Bravo 6, Charlie 6, whole short runway 27 for general aviation parking, November 350, Kilo Tango. <clears throat> all right, so looks like we're going to be taxiing all the way back down to the left, no problem. I got our taxi levers and our conditioners pulled back, and I got our landing lights off, taxi lights on, strobes are off. And, you know, uh, hopefully this records well. I think that was a pretty decent, uh, I think that was a pretty decent, uh, arrival. You know, <clears throat> given that this aircraft can be all over. So, this is Bravo, Ron. I'm very familiar with this, uh, airport. So we're on Bravo now. Let's see if we can pick up a nice little taxi speed down to Bravo 6. Then he's going to let us cross over, which then will turn to Charlie 6, and then on to the general aviation parking. The other day I flew this route with this aircraft, and I made I was able to touch down and make the, the right turn uh, onto the other side. Of course, there was no tower or ground on. But, you know, we adjust, and it's just a matter of crossing back over the runway. No big deal. You guys get to be with me for a little bit longer. So, again, thanks for humoring me and either fast-forwarding to the good parts or staying with me the whole way to see what was going on. Uh, I will definitely put in my dialogue or the notes for this video once I upload it that ATC was experiencing some server issues but uh, nonetheless we you know uh, worked with them just like they always work with us when we mess up because Lord knows I mess up quite frequently November 0 Kilo Tango clear to cross runway 27 continue taxi clear to cross runway 27 clear to, to continue taxi November 350 Kilo Tango. Alright, so that's Bravo 4. Hopefully, while I was steadily running my mouth, hopefully I didn't pass Bravo 6. If I did, then he'll let me know. Hopefully this is Bravo 6 here. Which I'm sure I probably passed it. Because usually the numbers are descending. Let's see, this says that it's Bravo. November zero kilo tango. I think you uh, might be on a different uh, scenery here. Go ahead and turn left next taxiway. Uh, so clear to cross runway 27. Roger, left next taxiway, clear to cross runway 27. And it was. Scenery is good. It was my error. <laughs> All right. All right. So we're going to cross here. And my hat's off to that guy because when you're just controlling ground and trying to obviously move up to center, um, you know, or, you know, it's like ground, uh, tower departure, maybe in Southern California, it would be SoCal approach, then center. So he's trying to work his way up in order to become a center controller. And that can take anywhere from a year to three years, so. All right. So here we go, and the general aviation parking is towards the end here, so we do know that. See, as I was just stating, that the center made mistakes, and uh, because I wasn't, and I just surely wasn't paying attention. Uh, 
I made a mistake and passed Bravo 6, so when I saw that he had given me the instructions to continue taxi and I was crossing Bravo 4, I was certain that I would pass it because I know the numbers descend all the way until you get to the end of runway, uh, to the end of runway 27, or to the beginning of runway 27, I should say. But, no worries, because he caught it, we knew it, and, uh, made it to our mistake and that's you know that's the most important part you know don't be bigger than your style just admit to your mistake and because lord knows i make more than a, more than a few so we'll continue down and probably next left turn we'll take it in that building over there that's the uh general aviation parking Bring it in right here. And that, of course, is into a spot, but I want to get closer to the building, so we're just going to cut across because my esteemed passengers have most certainly paid Windberg Ground, good evening, South of Top Dollar. 396 for requesting after clearance to Las Vegas with information golf on board. In order not to have to do the long walk to the building. Good evening, South of 1796, Windberg Ground. We've got that clearance for you. Clear to Las Vegas McCarran Airport. Level 6 departure, Santa Catalina transition, then is filed, climb via SID, except maintain 5,000, expect cruise, five minutes after departure. Departure frequency is 125.8 and squawk 5727. All right, hopefully we're lined up straight. We're clear to Las Vegas via Bill 6 Park, Santa Catalina transition as well. Um, Taxi light off. Departure frequencies on 125.8 and squad 5727 South West 1796. Beacon off. Southwest 1796, read back correct. Yeah. Expect runway 27 advice when ready for taxi. Roger, we'll expect runway 27 and we'll call in order for taxi. We made it! 96. By the skinny skin skin of our chinny chin chin. And let me turn the rudder boost off. And that's off. I'm going to shut number one down since passengers disembark on the left side. And we'll keep the other engine on for now. Let me just bring the idle back down a little bit. Let me shut one down. And let me turn off generator for number one door is open so we didn't quite go all the way up but let's get our door open there <laughs> and the door must not want it's probably not going down because the engine's on so let's do this let's shut it down even though we both know that the aircraft will probably lose power here in a second and they're off so maybe the door will stay open this time there we go and it comes back up anyway so it's a little glitch but anyway we arrived, that's it. We pulled into our parking space. This is still rotating, so maybe as soon as that stops, the door will actually stay open. Let's wait for the rotation to stop here. Let 
All right. Slow it down. There we go. Let's try now. And the door's back up. There we go. So anyway, uh, gotta love it. We made it. Let's turn our squawk mode off and let's end it here. I appreciate you guys staying with me. Uh, hope you enjoyed the flight. I'm human. Air traffic controllers are human. Problems happen. I make mistakes. Let's face it. It makes it fun. Nos vemos next time. We'll see you next time. And uh, thanks for watching.